New perspective unlocked. Spiritual emergencies versus mental health. So on the face of it, you're not really going to be able to tell the difference because subsequently the process is exactly the same for both. And the reason it's exactly the same for both is because it's all part of the greater picture or the bigger picture. And when we have a look at the overall structure, what we're looking at is breaking down each of the components to get back to what is in essence our spirit. And when we have a look at the spiritual element, that is the top line element. And then you have the mental thought processes coupled with the emotional breakdown. And then you have the physical element that manifests into reality. And when we go up this chain, we're then looking at going up through these structures and then subsequently we get to the spiritual emergence having dealt with the mental constructs. So when we go and have the mental health check, we will have a position whereby much of our stuff is actually going to break down. So it doesn't matter how mentally strong you are, it doesn't matter if your thought processes are in check, there will be different levels of growth and there will be different levels of ability within those parameters that then facilitate your own personal growth and development. And then that personal growth and development will then subsequently have a higher level of learning, which is basically life lessons and personal spiritual growth. So when we go back to mental health versus spiritual emergencies, we're literally combining the two rather than treating them as separate instances. And you will have the mental breakdown. And that mental breakdown itself will facilitate the next stage of growth. It will facilitate the new identity that needs to come through. And it will also put you in prime position to then understand any and all events that have gone before and that need to be cleared for you to then obviously have the overall spiritual emergence that then becomes your next phase of life or your next lessons or your next stage that you then have to then process through. And that in itself will give you new life experiences and those life experiences will then further develop both mental, spiritual, emotional and physical elements in order for then growth to facilitate itself across any and all levels based on where you're at and where you're going. But as always, until next time, trust the process and it's bye for now.